Welcome back to our channel. Today, we will talk about the Australian MQ-4C Triton drone. The MQ-4 Triton is an unmanned aerial vehicle known for its long altitude endurance. The aircraft designed to provide an unparalleled level of situational awareness and maritime surveillance enhances real-time decision-making at tactical and strategic levels. Previously, the MQ-4C Triton was based on the ARC for N, the maritime variant of the ARC for B Global Hawk. The MQ-4, developed by the Northrop Grumman Company, was produced for Royal Australian Air Force Service. The initial unmanned vehicle contract awarded to Northrop Grumman in 2022 for $11.5 billion is for the production of 65 units of the advanced MQ for C Triton Yav with multi-sensor upgrades. Australia is a cooperative partner in Triton's MQ for C program. The Australian government had agreed to acquire the MQ for C aircraft for $1.4 billion in June 2018. The Triton fleet stationed at RAF Base Tyndall in the northern region will be operated by newly reformed No. 9 Squadron at RAF Base Edinburgh, South Australia. This is part of a four-unit order, and it is likely that more orders will be added in the future. Obviously, the Royal Australian Air Force uses it to perform a variety of missions, including maritime surveillance, search and rescue, and threat detection. The primary purpose of the MQ for C Triton drone is to provide persistent maritime surveillance capabilities and serve as a complement to the P-8 Poseidon manned aircraft, as well as supporting the Navy's Wide Area Maritime Surveillance BAMS program. Regarding its mid-air drive, the MQ-4 is powered by a Rolls-Royce E3007 hours engine. Despite having a gross takeoff weight, its maximum design is 33,000 pounds. However, its speed can reach up to 600 kilometers per hour and is capable of operating at an altitude of 54,100 feet or 16,490 meters during flights of more than four hours. No need to be surprised if the Royal Australian Air Force easily guards its maritime territory. Because the MQ-4C is equipped with advanced sensors that can collect intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance ISR data, including Signal Intelligence SIGINT, Electronic Support Measures ESM, and Electro-Optical, and Infrared EO or IR video cameras. Features sensors installed on the MQ-4, based on components or entire systems already included in the Defense Department inventory. The MQ-4C Triton's unique mission sensor suite is designed to operate from five orbital operational sites around the world and provides 360-degree coverage of all sensors, making it easy to use for search and rescue operations, as well as to support carrier strike groups. No wonder its durability is extraordinary. MQ-4 can operate more than 24 hours in the air. The operator can work effectively while performing long surveillance missions and can operate to any region during flight in the air. Its cruising range can reach 15,000 kilometers or 9,320 miles. Of course, 
This drone is included in the category of the strongest unmanned vehicle compared to other platforms. Try to pay attention. This technological aircraft is classified as a giant drone because it has dimensions of 14.5 meters long, 4.7 meters high, and a wingspan of 40 meters. The MQ-4C is capable of carrying a maximum internal payload of 1,460 kilograms, and its external payload can be carried of 1,090 kilograms. Australia's MQ-4C Triton drone, first unveiled in September 2022 at Northrop Grumman's production site in California. It then completed its maiden flight in November 2023 after addressing technical issues that delayed its initial taxi test. Following the completion of all aircraft trials, the US Navy has conducted calibration tests and certifications before handing over the drone to the Royal Australian Air Force without waiting for further delays. As for the price of the MQ-4C Triton drone, this depends on the specific configuration and the number of units ordered. The total cost of the Triton program includes the production and delivery of drones as well as related support services, technical expertise, and administrative data related to the aircraft. After significantly modernizing this unmanned vehicle, including the introduction of four integrated functional capabilities, or MQ for C Triton Multi Int Enhanced Signal Intelligence SIGINT capabilities. Of course, the US Navy will retire the EP3 Ares because Triton will take over the task of intelligence gathering in the future, although this is still done by Ares. <laughs>